Greetings and salutations. It is Saturday, March 7th, and I got I got a request um, because yesterday I went and got a bunch of music rolls and I got a request to show how to get the Lament to the Highborn one, which is in the Undercity, um, but it's very possible for Alliance to get it. I got it on my um, on, on Khalid on my main. So I'm going to show you how to do this as a horde because it'll be easier than having to run back from the graveyard, but this is essentially how you're going to do it. So you're going to go to Tirasfall Glades, where Undercity is, and you're going to go west of the Undercity, right here, where my little guy is, and you're going to see this little cave. This is only going to work if you have Azeroth flying. Um, if you haven't gotten Azeroth flying yet, save up and get it. Otherwise, well, it'll work, but you're, you're going to be doing a lot of corpse running. So you're going to go in the sewer. And you're just gonna follow it down. If you're doing, if you've got a group of people doing um, the raid at the time, that's even better because then there's a whole bunch of people to kind of keep the guards off you and whatnot. And you're gonna follow the big main line of green, and then it's gonna drop out, and you're gonna hang a right, and you're gonna want to go into the apothecarium. Sylvanas is here in this little circle, the lair of the Banshee Queen or whatever it's called. So we're gonna follow this around. Just follow the little circle of green until you get to the southwestern quadrant, the Apothecarium. And you're going to go in through this, the bigger one of the arches with the fancy steps in front of it. Um, you can see it says Royal Quarter in here. And you're just going to follow this through. Fly high enough that the guards shouldn't uh, do too much damage to you. They're going to they're gonna pull. Um, but that's about it. And then you want to die. Where's the, this one? You want to die right about here. This is about where you want to die. You can try and get it, but you're going to have a heck of a time doing it. So then um, it's, the box will be right here. It only shows up once you have the garrison, once you have the jukebox mission, the jukebox quest completed. So if it doesn't, sh you can see it doesn't show up right now because I'm only level 94, but there's going to be like a strong box right here where I'm standing. And you'll click on it and the music will be in there. Now, if you're Horde, you've just got it, no problem. If you're Alliance, this is where it gets a little bit tricky. So you're probably not going to be able to click on it because you're going to have so many guys with you, uh -uh, so many guys on you because these guys all um, aggro as well. And there is a bat that is constantly patrolling, the Forsaken Bat, and it's level 100. So you're going to probably die right about here. You want to die as close to this pillar as you can. And then what you're going to do is once you're dead, you're going to hug the very edge and get back here Then turn your camera so you can see the other side. face this way. Okay, turn the camera so you can see the other side. You're going to res and you're going to click it. And as long as you are in the middle and click click um, accept, resurrection, accept resurrection as soon as that bat passes you. So as soon as the bat gets to right about here and you can see it and it leaves your screen. Actually, no, wait, I'll watch. We'll watch. So there it is. There it goes. So it's there. It's there. Okay, now res and you're going to click. You're going to open it, you're going to get the item, and then you're going to open it and you're going to garrison hearth right away because it's the fastest hearth. And by the time you're done, the bat's just coming up. And that's it. That's how you get it. You are going to have to die. Um, and the really crappy part about this, um, if you're doing this as alliances, you probably are going to die. If you can manage to not die and still do that, that's great. I don't know if you're going to be able to hearth and do it at the same time, but um, the downside to having to run back is the graveyard is right over here. So you kind of have to trek for a while. It gets really annoying. You can't use the graveyard in the Undercity because that's a horde-only graveyard if you're Alliance. But other than that, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it. It's it's a really, in terms of going for it, it, as long as you can get yourself killed right by that pillar, just book it for that pillar. Use any um, movement speed buffs that you have. Um, Try and stealth out if you can, um, but you want to you want to absolutely die right by that pillar, and then just res, run back. That's it, pretty much. It's a pretty simple one in terms of like going for opposite faction horde. You guys aren't gonna have any issues with it. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, thank you so much for watching, and tomorrow will be a vlog, and then I will be up on Project Chronicle tomorrow as well, talking about tea, which I'm looking forward to. And it's going to be chai. Ooh, I think that's my favorite kind of tea. So that'll be fun. Anyway, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.